Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to go ahead and do this um, look that it's suited best for monolid Asian eye. Um, one of my friends told me that she is starting to get into um, eyeshadow right now and she doesn't know how to create an uh, eyeshadow look, a smoky look for like Asian eye. She, she has kind of a monolid hooded eye so this is going to be best for anyone but I am doing this for you. If you want to see how I did this look, keep on watching. Starting off with this big eyeshadow brush, I'm going to use the Wet n Wild in Creme Brulee or Cobb Brulee to put it along my brow bone, my eyebrow. So this will kind of shape my eyebrow. You could use any eyeshadow um, that it's closer to your skin tone. Using my Naked Palette, I'm going to go in with the color Hustle. It's right here. It's kind of like a purplish brown. And I'm going to put it as a half moon shape on the closer to the lash line. And I will only put it up to where the fold is. And I stop right here so that way I can put a lighter shade to brighten up the eye. Going in with the blender brush using the color Naked. This will go ahead and buff out the line. And it'll be our transition color as well. Going back with the flatter shader brush, getting Hustle again. And I'm just going to darken the color just in case we blend any of the true color off. Using a pointer brush, Color Virgin, I'm going to highlight the inner tear duct as well as bringing it closer to blend in with Hustle. the blender brush again I'm going to go with sidecar it's a shiny glittery color I'm going to just place this right in the crease as you can see I kind of bring the color slightly above where my fold is so that way it peeks through although you have Asian eyes or monolid or hooded eye this kind of helps to at least define the eye as well when you kind of bring it slightly up on eyeliner I'm going to kind of define the lower lash line and your brush taking a bit of the sidecar and then afterwards going to take a little bit of the hustle so start with sidecar going to place this right in the middle now using Hustle, blending on the outer parts. And pulling it into where so you place sidecar. So that way it has a nice transition. It blends very well. And this is when I define my lash line a lot more. I use Hustle and I just kind of define the outer part of the lashes. Q-tip is a handy tool to kind of clean up any of your uh, mistake or just to make it look more uh, defined. So currently I'm using this uh, Maybelline Masterpiece, it's in my January favorite. In the mascara, I'm using this uh, MAC False Lashes um, little free samples that they gave. I'm going to coat all my lashes. put some 
mascara on the lower lash line. I don't have much, but if you do have some, this will kind of open up your eyes. I know a lot of Asian, we don't really contour our face, but I think bronzing contouring might be a little bit better for um, us because our face is a lot more pale or it may appear looking flat. So I am going to go ahead and contour with my NARS Laguna, just tapping a little. And I'm just going to place it right under where my ear is and stop where, about where your eyes um, starts right here so like I naturally have slight um, shadow already so if you don't have it you just squeeze your like do fish face mm -hmm. and just place it right here don't put too much um, if you do have a little too much go ahead and blend it out or use like your powder brush to kind of blend it a little then bring it down to your jawline and bring whatever left over onto your temple. And brush a little bit on your hairline. So for my blush, I'm going to use the Hourglass Moon Exposure. It's the pink one. And I always do highlighter at the end, like I always go bronzer, blush, and then highlighter. And today I'm going to use my Hourglass in Incandescent Light, which is the one right in the middle. With a little fluffy brush, I'm going to place it right there, right above the blush. I'm going to also put it on my brow bone and above my brow. Using this Sonia Kasha is from Target, uh, the number 82 in nude pink. And this is the look and I hope you like it. Don't forget to subscribe, follow me on Instagram and Facebook, as well as blog, uh, my blog. Um, all the information is on the uh, information bar below. <laughs> and I hope you like it. See you soon.